welcome my viewers or back to for Discovering University. I haven't recorded this in a long time. I don't remember the last time I did. It's been a while. I really miss recording it too. I, I love all the characters in it. So I decided to finish it. And it's going to be on Thursdays, which is going to be a temporary thing. I don't normally upload on Thursdays unless I have an, an extra Let's Play or extra video or whatever. But I wanted to do this one again. So that's why I brought it back. Good morning, Ed. Good morning. What's wrong, Ed? Nothing. You don't sound too happy. I've been waiting for my breakfast. I don't know why Ed's not happy. I think he's upset with me for something. I can't imagine why. Think like Gamer, if you're watching this, I'll let you know she kicked me earlier and it really hurt my feelings. And then she says, when she's gonna get done with this let play, she's gonna leave me here in this house and move them other people to Solani. Therefore, I just get ignored and left in the dark. Who's calling you? Somebody, okay, Britain Chell was, is telling you to go to Batu. No thanks. I didn't been there. Well, Ed, you can go to Solani if you want to. I'm not saying you can't. I, I just give the option just so you wouldn't have to move again. Oh, excuse uh -huh. me. You did what now? I said you can move Solani if you want to, but I just gave you an option to have this this house so you wouldn't have to move again. I don't want to stay here in this fucking town. It's a college town. Yeah. Makes sense. I can find you a house in Solani you can stay in. That's fine. You, Fiona, and Ed Jr. can live in a house in Solani. Right, it's tropical paradise, so why not? If you let Pinja Coladas and getting caught in the rain, Ed. Anyway, Ed, how do you feel about having ham for breakfast? It's a lovely sensation. All right, Fiona and Leonardo are back from their classes. Oh, Rachel man. has oh, she has a class now. I think she has to take her final exam. Is this her last? Oh, it's her last day of class. What I was gonna do whenever it was her, whenever it was the last term, the very last term for her, I was gonna have her graduate and then the very last episode would be Ed, Leonardo, and Fiona graduating. That was how I was gonna end it. I was gonna have Rachel stay here. Just a show of support to Ed, Fiona, and Leonardo. That was my plan. Nice game. I wasn't gonna let her graduate and then end it. That wouldn't be fair. I was gonna have all of you graduate. So it's Rachel's last day of class for this term. And then the rest of you have four days left. Ed, you don't even have your full homework done? Where is your homework? I have no idea. It's been fucking a year ago. Where did it go? Disappeared like everything else does on this damn game. Fucking all kinds of furniture disappears and all kinds of shit. Well, I didn't give your final presentation if you wanted to. Okay. But I don't know where your homework went. Are you sure I did it? Oh, you know your homework book. Where did it go? I don't know. Did I have to buy you another one? Huh? Look around, see if it's somewhere. There's huh? Smokey. Yeah. Huh. Maybe, maybe somebody stole it. Yeah, everybody else has their homework. For some reason, you don't. I don't know. I don't know either, Ed. <coughs> Let's go. You haven't put it in the year, so we ate it. I may have. That's so damn hungry. 
All right, how about your presentation? And I don't know where your homework went. I'm serious. Where is Buy me a book, hey. I have to buy you a new one. Yeah, I am a criminal in a damn motherfucking thing anyway, so hey. Nothing, not in here. That's so weird. I guess I gotta purchase you another one. There's a game made it. There. Man, that was ham. I don't see why the game would think that, but... Who knows? Ed Hulk I may have. I did. Uh, I can't find your inventory because you're gone. That's <laughs> weird. <clears throat> I guess I'm taking the skate with me. Oh, Fiona has class. I forgot about that. Whoops. Rachel is back from her final exam. I guess we'll see what her grades are. Oh, she's done with school, right? No, she's done with this term, but she has one more term after this one. Oh, she's done with it. No. I decided to do two classes instead of four. I thought you were going to keep up with all the rest of us. I am. No, I mean, I thought you were going to catch all of us up. That's what I'm doing. That's why I. You can't. We're four days away. Well, it'll be it'll be more closer because all of you have four classes a piece. It'll be more closer. So you'll do. That, that's why she's I said she's still gonna graduate before we do. Yes, and that's why I was gonna wait for the last episode and for all of you to graduate. I see. That that's what I said before. I know. And that's my like I said, it wouldn't be fair just have her graduate and then end it because it would be basically a cliffhanger so oh. hey nanny grace yes honey anything going on with sexy rexy uh he just say my last he always is you know how it is i just wonder if he's caused any more drama recently he does. He bugged the shit out of me. He wants to see them kids. And I said, hell no. He ain't seeing none of them. Well, he was the one that made Katrina get rid of the child on Gracie's doorstep, if you remember. I know, and he wants to see him, Mom, but he ain't going to. But he wants to see them now? Yeah, he's trying to get back into her life. What? I th okay, what happened with Katrina? They don't get along. Oh, really? They never have, actually. It seemed like he was all uh, over her. Uh, we have a protection order. He can't come anywhere near her or the kids. And, uh, okay, so since... What? Okay, so what happened with him and Katrina otherwise? Does he not like her anymore, supposedly? He never did like her. He just thought she had money, but she don't. He likes to cheat on people, you know. Yeah, and apparently Katrina likes to cheat on Don for sexy Rexy. And whoever is. Is he upset? Because did, did <coughs> Katrina, I know that Katrina was thinking about going back with Don, wasn't she? She is. She wants to. She wants him out of the house. No, I don't know where you come to. He'd be better stay the hell away from Solani. I bet Walt won't take him back. Or he might, I don't know. No, I would not no man. No, I would not. Especially the way he treated Gracie and everything. He told me that I get an apartment in the city. Um, Leonardo was hungry, Ed. And you just ate the ham anyway. I was just telling you because Cheshire Bing Kappa Baru Subao Havery Umfra Nibana. Oh, that's Ed's homework. I was why did you leave it on the floor? Has Katrina said anything about wanting the child back or no? I don't know. She didn't want her back, him back or whatever. She don't want to see it too weird. Do you wish 
You looked as happy as I do. Well, you have the power to send one simoleon to me. Don't delay having this just simoleon away. That's that scammer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Rachel's not gonna fall for that at all. Yeah, she just buy gear. She can go buy <laughs> Ed, you have one more presentation to do. You wanna do it? I guess hell. Wait, you're bringing time. your ham while giving a presentation? First the pizza rolls, now this. Not leave the food behind hell! You already know me! <laughs> this is the second time you brought food with you to give your presentation. You had to finish your kids by ace. So I'm bringing it. You left the plate on the ground. I finished it. What would Professor Jean think? Or, yeah. Who's that woman? Shelly Kim. I see. Okay, you left the plate on the ground. Um, Ed Jr.'s being bad. I don't know why, but he is. Yeah, he is. Yeah, and his mama ain't even looking after him. She's doing her homework, Ed. You still gotta watch your kids. You got kids, you don't matter. She can discipline him. For some reason, our hunger's down. You and Fiona have a full bar on your relationship and and friendship. Perceived as extremely attractive, Fiona thinks Ed Polk is extremely attractive. And now you look surprised. I'm not. I'm just, I'm just waiting. I was just waiting for your reaction to what you would say. I know I'm extremely tra attractive. I know I'm sexy as hell. Ed Polk always knows this. And her thinking that just confirms it, so that's good. She loves you anyway. We made anyway! No, I'm gonna say she loves you anyway. That's what I mean, Ed. Oh, you're saying she would love me if I'm ugly and... Oh, I see. No, that's not what I said. Yeah. No, I mean she loves you anyway. Nanny Grace, help! Ed Pokes... Just ignore that idiot hell. You know how he is. That's not what I meant, Ed. Nobody's ugly, and you know that. I know. I just like to get you fucking that and roaring around. Kick. Ah! Kick wave. Get your get her ass. <laughs> Sir, are you right, Ed? Good job. No. Okay. Uh, Tiffany Rose is playing with her tablet in the bathroom. I don't know why. But I guess we'll see what Rachel's grades are in, the, in a little bit. I don't know. I guess we'll see. And they're still a mess. Leonardo returned in his homework confidently and Ed put enough work to... Okay. Uh, poor Ed. Ed. Still Ed thinks this will help his, his final grade. That's good. Fiona's teaching Ed Jr. how to say sorry. I see. So this will help whenever he makes a mess. Now I teach him how to say not really. <laughs> you do? Oh, yeah. Of course. Of course you're going to teach him that because that's how you are because you're Ed Polk and you don't lie. My shit. You're back home, Ed. How did the presentations go in your class? Whoa. I smell food. I'm hungry. <laughs> it went lovely. What do you want? What do you want to eat for dinner, Ed? Pork. You ran out of ham. Oh hell no! Rachel's gonna cook more ham for you. 
Well, not just for you, for everybody. Why ain't my girlfriend gonna fix it? Because Fiona's busy with her homework. She has, she's doing her, home, her homework just like you are. I see. And Rachel has her final grade anyway, so she doesn't have any homework to do. I'm sure she would have fixed you, Ham, otherwise if she wasn't doing her homework just like you were. Ha! And everybody else is busy except for Rachel, so... That's why. I see. See, look, she went, she went to sit next to you and to do your, I guess both of you do your homework together. And ass. I swear, I just not seem happy at all for some reason. I don't know why. <clears throat> I can't imagine why I would not be happy. Why'd you kick me for? No, I'm just saying, kick! Rachel has an A plus in both her classes. That's good. Maybe you aren't throw a party for her. How about you, busy studying? You can do a party. Nah. No, this is our last class. This is our last semester. Hmm. Nothing. Well, she's gonna have homework. When she have class? She can start on her homework and stuff tomorrow. She's cooking cooking level seven now. Wow, that's good. Mm. Maybe the ham won't suck now. Mm. <laughs> did it did it before? Sometimes. It kinda dry, but I still liked it. It was too good. You you make no sense. You like everything. That's true. I don't mind crunchy ham sometimes. Hers is kinda crunchy. Alright, you gonna have a keg party? Why not? You're the host. You want out. I don't know, nobody really to invite though. Except for I guess all three of you. Or all and four of you. family? I think it would have to be her as the host then, if that was the case. <coughs> so let's take it off, I say. Hang on a minute. Let me let me have her host this then. I think her family want to celebrate with her. Oh, there we go. Now we can do it. I have you as the host still, so don't worry. No, oh, no, we're not inviting sexy Rexy. Why is orange juice? I think it's from the Halloween party. Oh. Can we invite the whole family? Can you? No, I can't. Oh well. Where's Walt? Oh, I can't invite Walt. Oh well, I guess we can't. Why not? I guess he doesn't. I guess he doesn't really know Walt. She should. I don't know. All right, what time are you gonna have the party, Ed? What time is it? Um, six twenty-one. Now. That's seven o'clock. Oh, never mind. <laughs> All right, where's your keg? I think everybody's arrived. Well, not everybody, but... Hi, Nanny Grace! Hi, sweetie! What you doing? Ed Polk wanted to throw a keg party for Rachel's A-plus grades. That's good. I'm here. For some reason, Walt can't come. Did you say he couldn't? No, I, I don't know if this was a relate. Does she know Walt? 
I guess not. I don't know why. It makes Her no brother's sense. married to his granddaughter. Don't ask me. Hang There's on. Great granddaughter. Let me try something. I'm gonna have Walt show up anyway. There you go, Walt. Now you're coming. T thanks. Alright, everybody, stop doing your homework. Thank you. Well, you're having a keg party. Why is everybody on laptops? I don't know why. Nobody's drinking anything. Do a keg stand, let's see, with Nanny Grace, that'll be perfect. Oh my god, really? I gotta do a damn keg stand with that motherfucker? Thanks a lot, Nicole. No, Rachel and you. Oh, okay, that's fine. Hi, Walt. Hi. Hi, Orange Juice. Hello. I'm so excited. Is Walt sad? What's wrong, Walt? That sexy Rexy won't leave me alone. What happened? It was sitting back in with me and I told him no. Alright, the ham's done. I'm on it. Why hit it with the guys? What? Ooh, why hit it on the guys? Is that her husband? <laughs> yeah, it's Barry, remember? Okay. Is this Barry? Did you give Barry a voice or no? Um, I don't think so. I don't, I don't remember. I don't think so. Where's Al? Yes. Alright, ready now, Grace? I'm always ready, honey. <laughs> How about you joining this fun orange juice? Yee! Ed. <coughs> Nanny, Nanny Grace and Rachel have a sentiment together. What does it say? What's with Ed? It says, growing closer from quality time. Aww. Yeah, my wife, Ed. He's me. Oh, there's nothing left. Oh, no. Well, no. It only feeds... Yummy. Oh, yeah. Oh, Gaba. He didn't even drop you. 
He's drowned. Hey, Ed, you want a drink? Uh, <laughs> Is everybody having a good time at the yeah, party? Yeah, most empty. I'm not having a wonderful time. I don't know about everybody else. Why in the world everybody randomly wants to say there I go fix it? But you tell oh. shut up. No, I just I just did reset debug. Oh my god, it's hunger. I wanna fix that real fast. Who kicked the trash can over? I don't know. I didn't say who did it. Walt? Did you kick the trash can over? Why would he do it? Are you okay, Walt? I'm alright. Who in the hell knocked this over? I'm a whole bitch and everybody damn switches out. Why is she playing in it? Nanny Grace? <laughs> Nanny Grace? I have no idea why I just did that. I'm confused about it too. That's damn shit. I'm fucking tired as hell. There, Ed. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Is Orange just fishing? Or did he talk to someone about fishing? Oh my god. <laughs> that's my husband! <laughs> oh my god, that's funny. Walt got a drink. That's good, actually. Did you have Rachel and Walt talk? Yeah. Yeah, I, fi I fixed her friendship. Oh, I didn't know. <laughs> Alright, did everybody else get to eat? I don't know. I can't tell with them. Ed Jr. has some food. <laughs> Tiffany Rose went to bed. Did she eat? Yeah, she did. All right, there's ten left, and we're gonna put it in the fridge. <laughs> Lily and Adam are, are doing the text dance. <laughs> Rachel's gonna go in and hug orange juice. Let's see. There it is. Oh, the party's on the... Oh, Walt has to go. Bye, Walt. I hope you had fun. Hey, boy. Thanks for inviting me. I hope that helped you forget about what was going on with Sexy Rexy for a while. Aww. What are you doing, Orange? <laughs> I get you! Uh -oh, she's mad now. No, she's not mad. I think she. I think she's fine with it. No, the red mark negatives go up. Rachel's hungry. Oh, she, I thought she got some food. Okay. She was really nice supposed to eat. Oh, the party's over now. Hope everybody had fun. Bye, everybody. I'll see y'all later. Rachel, I'll call you later, honey, in the morning. Yes, Nanny Grace wanted to make sure everybody was going home safe first. Bye, TikTok. See you later. Um, Rachel went through the couch. Wait. Barry, you still here? Ed Junior should be. <laughs> Whose homework is this? Leonardo's. Oh, he's putting Ed Junior to bed for you, Ed. That's nice. Thank you very much. Right, I think everybody should head to bed, and then we should end this part here. Oh, Ed's already asleep. I had no idea. I 
I'm tired. Can't be a phone night. Hey, you wanted to do a party. I know, it's fun. Who left Ooh. their homework? Uh -huh. Of course it was Ed. <laughs> it's like it's lost. Yeah, Ed, it's like it's lost. I think Smokey ate it. Anyway, here is your keg. Maybe you feel back Ooh, up. You mouth. Oh, Nanny Grace did the rest of the drink. I'm just gonna go put these away then. Oh, she's exhausted. At least she doesn't have class for a few more days. Until a few more days. But in the next part, she will do her homework. What the heck? Who is this? Who is this? I don't say. Secret Society member. How did she get there? Who wasn't invited? Where did she come from? I don't know. Nanny Grace? I have no idea, but I'm gonna be fucking checking her out. Hang on, Rachel's gonna go talk to her real quick. Now I'm curious. I'm sorry, this might be a little bit longer because of all this, but... Now, I'm, I've never seen the Secret Society before, so I want to see what this is about. Oh, she left already? Aw. Wait, there she is. She's part of the Secret Society. Maybe she's gonna give her a friendly introduction then. So we can know her. So, so. <laughs> or she can know her, I mean. Ed? I don't have any idea. Okay, she's leaving now, but. How was. I've never seen that before. That was. interesting. Alright, now we should probably go and end this part now. I didn't know what was going to happen. Who's bicycle? That's oh, Rachel's. Alright, we're going to go ahead and end this part here now since Rachel has a little bit of things to do. And it's probably going to be even more longer than... Then normally I planned it, but I hope all of you don't mind. <clears throat> Thank you all so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you have the notification bell to get notified time I upload. Secret society is, 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 is intriguing. I think so too, Ed. I love you all so much. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye, everybody. Goodbye everyone, it's Ed and the Ed Lions. I was on the Wonder Years as Kevin Arnold. Thanks for telling me, Fred. You're welcome. Goodbye. Goodbye, it's Edgar.